The New Librarian. It was almost story time. The children were ready. Dee couldn't wait. Isn't it time? She asked, but no one answered. Jack looked around. Our librarian isn't here, he said. Maybe she's just late, said Dee. Miss Merriweather is never late, said Kenzie. Then she's missing," said D. "Let's go find her. Look, a clue, footprints," said D. "They aren't grown-up footprints," said Jack. "They aren't kid footprints," said Alex. D looked closer. "They're paw prints," she declared. They followed the paw prints among the bookshelves, through a galaxy, into an ocean, and down a runway. And spotted more clues. The librarian's desk feels sticky," said Jack. "These books are shredded and torn," said D. And then they looked up. And saw a new librarian. You're not our librarian. Where's Miss Merriweather? Dee asked. The new librarian shrugged. Will you read us a story? Dee asked. The new librarian nodded. "Hooray!" cried the children. "A princess story, a pirate story, a book about dragons." The new librarian looked bored. "How about something different?" Gemma suggested. "Something exciting," said Jameson. "Something we aren't allowed to read." Said Tom. Could you read us a scary story? Asked he. The new librarian's ears perked up. He grabbed the book. About bears. He opened the book and roared. E. The children screamed. He growled and stomped, and roared some more. The children loved it. Read it again! They cried. Someone's coming," said D. It was the missing Miss Merryweather. Sorry, I'm late," she said. A volcano erupted in the ancient history section, and there was hot lava everywhere. But it's all cleared up now. Miss Merryweather opened her book. Today's story is Goldilocks and the Three Bears. Oh, we love bear stories! Dee exclaimed. Once upon a time, there were three bears: Papa Bear, Mama Bear, and Baby O. Where's Baby Bear? The children cried. I know you're hiding, Baby Bear," said Miss Merryweather. It's time to come out now. The new librarian shuffled over sheepishly. "Baby bear, my dear, you're late for story time too," said Miss Merryweather. The children waved goodbye as Baby Bear stepped back into his story. "Now let's start again," said Miss Merryweather. "And Baby Bear." A girl came to their house. Wait, where's Goldilocks? You know, don't you?
Thank you very much for joining me today and reading The New Librarian. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.